everybody and welcome to Ranger Ruby YouTube channels. Today in this video I'll be showing you guys four fun sites that you can explore more info on a national park while we are sort of stuck here at home. Uh, these are just some fun online sites that you can check out that provide you some useful information on national parks and some fun games as well. Let's go ahead and dive right on in. Okay, everybody, like I said, these are just going to be four sites that you can find online. All will be linked down below that you can just have some fun with national parks on. Um, originally, I was going to make this video on Web Rangers if I needed to, another one. But Web Rangers has shut down due to the fact that most browsers don't accept Adobe Flash. So we are going to be doing four alternative sites that you can find super cool information on and some fun national park games. So let's go ahead and check them out. And site number one, this National Geographic's Kids uh, National Park's Personality Quiz. So it's just a quiz on which national park fits you best. Now I have already shown this in a previous video I believe, but it was a really old one and I wouldn't be that surprised if you guys haven't seen it. So I'm showing this to you again. You can just start the little quiz and it'll tell you which national park is your personality. So I've taken this several times and most of the time I think actually all the time I get Great Smoky Mountains National Park. So it's actually a pretty fun quiz. You just go through and answer the questions. There are also more games on National Geographic Kids if you don't want to play those, but this one's specifically National Park related. Okay, and site number two, I almost did four, but two is Amazon. Now if you search National Park Games, literally hundreds of options come up. You can just scroll down through National Park games, Monopoly, there's National Park Uno, National Park Camp, National Park Monopoly, card games, just a bunch of games. And I have previously played some of these games on my channel and they are super duper fun and they actually teach you a lot about the parks. So I'd highly suggest you check out one of these because some of these are just traditional games with just national parks inserted into them. Like there's National Park Yahtzee, National Park Jenga. And I definitely suggest that you try these out because these are super duper fun. Now this next site where you can learn more about national parks, this actually isn't the site, this is just a site that names 31 of the world's most incredible national parks. But if you go to Google Earth, you can actually in some places get street views and you can actually see these national parks. So all you have to do is not do that, open Google, click this little part here and then scroll down, you got yourself Google Earth. And you can literally search any national park. Let's go ahead and search something. Why not Yellowstone National Park? So see lots of things come up while we do the first one. And here we are. And it's just super fun where you can actually see the landscape and the terrain. And if we scroll out a little bit, by a little bit, a lot of it. You can just see the park and you see the following surroundings and you can see the mountains and you can just truly explore these national parks as well as find some on-person views. So why don't we try out here? This seems to have an in-person view. Oh, now look at how cool this is. These are just super fun to explore. You can actually feel like you're virtually in the park without actually being there, which right now is something you might want to do for fun. And the final one, I've already previously made a video on this, but it is very fun and I highly suggest you check it out. It is how many national parks can you name in two minutes? And they challenge you to name 10. I usually can do a little bit better than that, but you just type them all in there. There's a timer and it's stressful and did they just slip your mind? But it is still such a fun way to spend your time and truly jog your memory on national parks. And you always want to keep going. You want to do it again. See if you can beat your own score. My score, I believe, is 37. That's not very good considering they're 63. But once you start playing the game, you'll understand why it's a little bit harder. And it's just fun, you know? It's like a BuzzFeed quiz. There's just some sort of way to have a game in national parks in the same time. 
Well, everybody, that's the end in today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up and comment down below with your thoughts. I'd love to hear from you. Also, be sure to click that red subscribe button and the little bell next to it to always know when I post new videos. Thank you all so much for watching again, and I shall see you next video. Bye!